What's up ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Smart Tech. Today's video is brought to you guys by JV Mac. Now this is of course their Vertoba 4K action camera. It features a 2.31 LCD touchscreen with 170 degrees wide angle lens coverage. This thing can actually work underwater with the casing and it has a Sony sensor with 20 megapixels that allows you to capture everything in the utmost best quality. Now with that said, it's waterproof up to 30 meters and features a mic as well so you can record all the audio going on around you. There's also an app for us. You can actually connect this to Wi-Fi and actually see what's going on on a bigger screen should you need to do that. But but at the same time, this has a screen on the back of it anyway, and it even has a cool little voice that tells you when the recording starts as well. Now, all in all, I'd say the build quality is also really good as well. Everything seems to be pretty sturdy, so if you drop this or throw this, especially without the case, you should be perfectly fine. And overall, I'd say it's pretty rugged as well. Everything featuring the battery that's built inside of it, everything's very compact. The touchscreen doesn't seem like it's going to shatter or anything. The lens seems like it's pretty durable as well and scratch resistant. So basically everything you could possibly need on a uh, action camera is built into this. Now speaking of battery life, this thing actually has 1200 milliamp batteries, but it doesn't come with just one battery. As I said, it has two batteries, so that's pretty awesome. So if you do run out of one, you can actually be charging one of them as you use the other one, and then that one runs out and you could be charging the other one and it keeps working as well. There's also HDMI built into this, and there are a few ports that make your life easier. For example, there is the really convenient charge port. Unfortunately, something that ticked me off a little bit is that this thing doesn't charge via micro USB. It actually charges via normal USB be or macro usb i guess you could call it and not a lot of those are around anymore so i do want to point that out but in my testing battery life has been pretty solid and overall it's not something that's going to die on you you should be able to keep on recording whether it's mounted on your head or wrist or anything of those sorts the last thing i'm going to go over is what this comes with now this is packed action packed when it comes to the bag itself first of all you get the carrying case it also comes with a wrist mount there's a head mount there's a full body mount there are mounts i don't even know what they do with there are multiple mounts where you can connect it onto a surface with little 3m sticky pads there there are even mounts for connecting this onto maybe your car or something of those sorts. All of that comes included at no additional cost. And the last thing, of course, is the most important aspect of this. How easy is it to use? And of course, uh, how, how is the overall functionality of the camera and its quality overall? So. First of all, this thing has the micro SD card, so enter whatever amount of storage you have on you. And afterwards, you simply hit a button and you can either take pictures or it will start a video. It'll actually prompt you. And with that said, you can actually tweak up the video. You can set it to a lower resolution if that's something that you want. But you can also set it to its full 4K resolution. They'll actually use Sony CMCO sensor to get you the best possible 4K it can at 24 frames per second. But if you want to shoot 2K, this thing can shoot 30 frames per second, and I assume it can shoot 1080 at 60 frames per second so it all depends on what you are looking for honestly 4k is usually pushing it i kept it at 2k and the footage looks pretty good the footage overall is clear it does need a little bit of tweaking the colors are a little blown out in some areas but with that said let's be real this thing's price comes in at super cheap and right now amazon actually has a 10 percent discount as well so for the price range i'd say it gets the job done it's pretty stable footage wise it's pretty clear and of course it can shoot very quickly and i think the main feature of this is that it's super portable and yet it's not pricey you know a lot of action cameras cough gopro you're gonna buy one of those for four or five hundred and you're gonna be abusing them you're gonna be throwing them and breaking them time and time again and those are really costly to replace here's something you know you can use and abuse and throw around and chuck in a bag and throw in your pocket and bring it wherever and you don't have to worry as much that you're throwing around almost half a grand worth of stuff so with that said guys go ahead and check out the link below thank you guys for watching this is going to be me logging off.